Hello and welcome again to another video having to do with Magic the Gathering. I don't think I'm going to talk like this for very much longer because it's a bit weird. Anyway, um, I know last week I talked about um, showing off a couple of decks, but I got one of these token things. <clears throat> Excuse me. And I've never done, I think I've maybe done it like twice, but I really have no idea what I'm doing. And I thought, you know what's funny? Watching me be an idiot. So, uh, you're going to watch me be an idiot with this token entry trying to create one card at a time from a rotating draft packs. The cards will be added to your collection, which is, hey, that's cool. And you'll use them plus basic lands to build a 40 card deck. Pay best of three matches and receive prizes based on how many matches I win. I'm going to do terribly, but this ought to be hilarious. Here we go. So. Let's see. I don't know. I said average wait time, a couple, couple minutes, but in, in the meat. Ooh, this filled up quick. Um, I'm going to get a drink. I probably should have done this before, but I'll be right back. See, I've missed a lot. And, uh, yep, I've got myself a Citizen Insider, the Dirty Mayor. Very good hard cider with ginger. <laughs> I know there used to be a thing we used to do fucking three years ago. On the, on the, when we did, when we did, uh, videos and it kind of went away because it's a lot of drinking granted it's kind of like once one a week but we did a lot of episodes that time okay what am i gonna go with we've got this is a very good deck card yeah the scythe is nice um you're pretty good Truffle snout, no. Eh. You're okay. Eh. Mm, flying, no. Do counters. <laughs> You're the steward, but I really think it's I think it's gonna be Liliana. And I'll see if I can't get a mill deck going around. Cause I think that's a thing you do. You wish you had a in uh forty decks is or forty card decks is it takes um, if you have cards, if you have things that will mill, it, it, it's more effective. So maybe I'll, I'll look towards a black deck and duress will help with that. When you increase your control with death touch, whenever creature control with death touch, you know, it destroys a planeswalker. That's handy. Um, duress is always good. <clears throat> Land cards, that's ramp, which would be handy with the Liliana. But I don't think I want that. I'm going to go with the rest. Very basic card. Let's see. Um, tap target creature. Eh, that's not that good. Return permanent card from a graveyard to my hand. If it died this turn. Sap rolling thing. Um, you sacrifice another creature. I don't think that's going to work for me. Zombie's good. Death touch, death touch or lifelink would be handy. Um, or four greater. Uh, I don't have that yet. Hmm. Uh, walking corpse or alchemist gift. See, this is me. You people are probably screaming at me. What the fuck are you doing? I'm gonna go with that. It's probably bad. All right, let's see what else we got here. That takes way too long to use. Control two or more non-land, non-token permanents. The same name as one another. Eh, that's, that's wordy. Yeah, it'll take a while. This could be handy for green black. This is also pretty handy, but it takes three red, uh, two red and... Hmm. 
I think I'll do run a foul. We'll see. It's probably going to be a useless card, but not much else here. Oop, more card discard. I like I like the uh, discard I might be having going here. Mine rot might be handy. Hmm. So we got something going here. We got getting rid of a card, sacrificing a thing. Weenie zombie. Get rid of two cards. Hmm. Um. Gain four life. If a creature died, you gain eight. Nope. That's not a bad flying with death touch for guaranteed removal. Hmm. Rise again would take way too long to use. So I think I'll go with the imp. <clears throat> Let's see. Yeah, I have a very bad uh, record with these. So, and I got that. Ooh. Each opponent loses life if they deactivate this only if a creature died this turn. Hmm. Jungle Hollow would be handy, but it's land. 1-1, one, one, Death Touch, Life Link would be handy. The Mauler. Hmm. That's a, that's a good card. I mean, it's expensive. But I think I'm going to do it. It's one of these three. Defender's not bad. I think, I think I'm going to do that. <laughs> I don't think that meow really fits with the, uh, the giant ass tiger. But what do I know? All right, another mine rot. Uh, spell, if you've gained three more, eh, life doesn't really happen all that much. A second mine rot, sure. All right, here we go. We do have a sorcery. We've got casted. Prismite would be useful, but I think I'm gonna go with the steward. I mean, we do have some sorcery, so that does help. We do not have any big, well, you do have death touch, so that's handy, but you're super expensive. So I think we'll do that. Although, we could start doing some milling, but that takes, again, it takes a long time to get to those to work. So I think I'll just take the Death Touch Dinosaur. Hmm. So what do we got here? Discard some cards. Just a zombie. Duress is handy. Alchemist Gift. Ah, sure, why not? All of these are bad. I'll do return to slay. I don't think I'm going to use it, though. That's going straight in the sideboard. Let's pop sideboard out. There we go. Sentinel. Shield mate. Ah. Uh, we'll do. We'll do this. Um. Eh. Healing's fine, I guess. Cage zombie. We'll take that. Alright. So, Grim Tutor for a card an easy way to get a specific card I'm looking for so that wouldn't be bad well we do have a flash hmm let's see second Dilopsor do one of these two we don't have much low level stuff so I think I'll <clears throat> I'll pick the black eye. That's probably bad. Which is cauldron, sacrifice some creatures. No. Oh, this would satisfy the the lopsor thing. Let's get rid of this for right now. Silent dart for ping. Uh, another duress. I think I want another duress. I think some of the other cards will come back around to me. I'm gonna put life goes on in here. Just I gotta mute. I had to clear my throat. Well, three duresses? That might be too much. Ranger's Guile could be useful. I think I'll take that. Come on. We have to wait for other people to give us their 
Dex, get out of this room. I gotta open a door. See if any ambient noise makes its way through the mic here. Oh, we've got a log jam. Alright, so. Sabertooth would actually help with this. But, hmm. Alright, here we go. Ooh, we do have a mill. So it'd either be the Prismite, one of any color, or the Thieves Guild Enforcer, which I think I like this because it, it'll give me death touch if there's enough things milled in it. So it, it, it it's going to help. Uh, the Archer's here. Second run of Foul. What's Fierce Empath? Six or greater. I don't have any that are six or greater. Skeleton Archer, I guess we can do. One, one. You could ping anything. Sure. And they really want me to take duress. The three duresses or another one or each. I think I want another duress. We'll do it. Three duresses. That may be too many. But again, I don't know. Well, we're just over halfway through the deck here. Ah, come on. We got a log jam here with the guy in front of me for his deck. Now, what I should have done is just look for every card I don't already own and then get just so I can have for my collection. Okay, what do we got? You. A trample. Um, Truffle Snow would be handy. It's a cute little guy. Or do I want 1 0 Trample? That ain't that great. Although, I ah, will do it. We'll do it. Cade Zombie or Ranger Skyle. I don't think I got Ranger Skyle last time, so we'll do that for Hexproof. <clears throat> well, Ornery's here again. We'll take him. Why not? Alright. So, Prismite. One mod of any color. I got a cough again. Man, that just doesn't go away. Uh, I could sacrifice for three damage to any creature for one. Um, I think I want... I'm going to take the Prismite. Four duresses, or do I want a Gloom Sower? It's going to take forever to get to you. I feel. But we'll do it. Why not? Um, add random mana. I really want a Radiant Fountain. I guess we'll do Destructive Tampering. These are all bad. Sure, sideboard. These are bad. Sideboard. Bad again. Sideboard. Whole new deck. Alright, another Mine Rot. Rise again. Titanic Growth would be really good. Invigorating Surge could be handy. I have a phone message. Um, track down. I really think Titanic Growth is going to be the... Uh, Way to go to that one. Twin Blade Assassins. I can draw a card that way. <clears> hmm. <throat> so it's gonna be Death Bloom Thalid. Or this archer. This turns into a basically a 4-3, and this is just a 3-3 for it's kind of the same price, but this comes a token. One of these two. I gotta pick one. No, we're gonna try the archer. Rise again. Short sword's not bad. Second run of foul. Hmm. Hmm. Go straight to battlefield. So yeah, maybe. 
Let's see what the steward was. Ah, oh, yeah, it's a card discard. We'll try it. Oh, Pestilent Haze, all creatures get minus two for three. Um, hmm, let's see. Sacrifice creature, draw two cards. Reveal the top card of your library. Nope. So, Pestilent Haze or Infernal Scarring. Hmm. That's all creatures is minus two, minus two. I don't think I like that. I think I'm going to go with Infernal Scarring. Blood, got, gl blah, blah, blood Glutton. Jesus Christ, I can't talk. I think we're just going to do it. It ain't great. But we'll do it. So, six cards on sideboard. Hmm. Nah. Another log jam here. We'll, uh... I don't know how long these things usually take to actually finish. Ooh, Crip Lurker. That's bad. Hmm. I mean, I guess we'll do it. I guess. But it ain't great. So, 36 out of 40. I gotta trim this down to 40 cards. I forget. I don't think... I don't think land is included with these, so we're going to have to get rid of some stuff. Gloom Sour's here again. Uh, this could be good, actually, so I think we'll do it. Since I do have uh, Life Goes On here, or at least four, for the hope of actually pulling it. How many... Green, okay, 21 red, or 21 black, 9 green. Um, second flash. Colossal Dreadmaw wouldn't be bad, but if the game goes that late, but I doubt it. Witch's Cauldron? Hmm. I think we'll just do another mass black card. There could have been something there with that. Uh, another mind rot, sure. So we kind of have a death touch mill, hopefully. Another life goes on, sure, we'll take it. I am getting a headache. That's been going on for... 42 seconds. 18 minutes and 42 seconds. I'm paying attention. So we gotta be getting near the end. Do I like what I have? Kinda. Uh, another run of foul. Are there really gonna be that many flyings? <clears throat> I don't need that many life goes ons, do I? I think we'll do that. Track down. Let's scry again. Uh, any number? Sure. Uh, sure, we'll put it in the sideboard. I'll put you in the sideboard. <laughs> Give me a land. I got 20 things. Rare Mythics you collected exceeded four times the collection limit were converted to gems. Well, apparently I've got a bunch of those. 53 out of 40. I need to make a 40 card deck. Alright. Lance Fine. Crip Lurker. No. Yes. 
Yes. Yes, we will put you here. Put you there. No, I want you here. No, I want you here. Rise again, blood glut. Those are okay. Sabertooth Mauler's fine. Fine. Cade Zombie. I'm gonna get rid of Prismite. Crack down. If you don't want it. Titanic Growth I like. Eh. Walking Corpse. It's a two. These are fine. That's okay. The Imp's good. I think we're fine with this. The Steward, yes, yes. Yes. I only need one run of Owl, I think. Man. Are we really going to get a Gloom Sower? It's just like a big fuck you one? I don't know. Need to get rid of nine cards. Gotta keep the lands. We'll get rid of one duress, one mine rot. Cage zombie could be okay. The imp I like, scarring. That's not bad. Two of you. Maybe. Walking corpse really doesn't do anything. So we'll get rid of you. <clears throat> I like Titanic Growth, and I think the training's going to go. Only one steward, though. But I like... One ranger's guy, I'll show it. Run, run a foul's fine. Hmm. Only one... Diplof... Dilophosaur, I think we'll do. Um, so I gotta get rid of three. I like the I like these. Rise again could be of use. Liliana, I think I think we're gonna get that to work. I like mind rod. Um, edit imp. I want to keep scarring. I I want that. Steward, yes, 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 yes. Al yeah, we'll get rid of Alchemist Gift. I mean, it is an instant, but I think I think we'll I think we'll get rid of it. Do I want Blood Glutton? It does Life Link. All right, I gotta figure out what I'm gonna do. So I can gain three, that'll be fine. I like the Mind Rod. Cage Zombie. We're gonna get rid of Cage Zombie. You're good for instant. There happens to be some sort of attack. You can jump in there really low level and do some damage. I like... Uh, I can only sacrifice. But that could be handy. I'm a little light on removal, so I can't really get rid of Run Afoul. Hmm. I think we're... Alright. One Skeleton Archer. This is a terrible deck. <laughs> but, here we go. We're, uh... We're going to see how this does. It's going to do terribly. I can tell you that right now. But. Who knows. It is so much about luck. A little bit with. Uh, making sure you get. The correct cards to make whatever your dumb zany. Scheme. To work. Actually happen. And if there's some reason. They don't get their deck to work. There's also that. But here we go. I'm playing Jaw 17.
my anticipation on this is I'll be lucky if I win a game. I'm going to keep these. Instant duress. Get my dog to be on fire. Get rid of your card. Let me see what you got. Double vision. These are all pretty bad. And we'll get rid of double vision. You're going to scry. Come on. Thank you. We're going to put another one down. Get rid of some cards. Only two, but that's okay. Put another one down, just all attack. I have a very long time before I'm actually going to get any... Uh... Got haste. 4-4, four, four, I could potentially... Yeah. There is some potential here, so what I'm going to do is hold off. I will have Blood Glutton next. Let's see if they try to ping it. Because this will take it up to a 5-5. Five, five. I think I'm fine with just trading, though. Because you do have this, we'll give it 2 0. So, yeah, I'm going to let it go. Alright, you can sacrifice equal to the damage. Okay, so you're going to start um, surging you up. So, should I buff you now? I'm going to lifelink with the Blood Glutton now. No attack, so he's going to go... <clears throat> Other creatures get 1-0, so that's going to make him at least 3-2. Plus that will make him a 5-2, which will kill the Blood Glutton. So I'm not going to attack this turn. This was a sketchy play. Because if there's any removal, this could be bad. But I'm not... Going to attack. Not yet, at least. <clears throat> no blocks. Buff him now. You're thinking about it. I see you highlighting that one card. Okay. Two damage, and now you're going to sacrifice? Oh, two cards of removal, but he's gotten pretty strong now. All right. So I didn't have any mana to actually defense, and so I gotta wait again. I can't do anything this turn. This deck's terrible. So now we're just gonna wait. All right, yes, resolve. Pass to blockers. You're gonna block. And now you're gonna get Titanic growth. And now you're going to charge him up to a 2-0, or you're going to let him eat it. If he's got another spell to cast, he might try to sacrifice. That's fine. <clears throat> I'm fine trading that. Now I'm down to basically my last turn. I did not get... Anything to help me this turn. So I gotta hope that, uh... I can... Pull something out of my ass here. Okay, do have Death Touch now. Thankfully, that bought me a turn. If there's any sort of... Trample, he's gonna buff him, and I'm probably dead. But that's fine. We've at least hit pause. Alright, so 
put you out. And I can't do mine rot. So we're kind of floating this turn. Here comes some sort of big ass spell that's going to kill me. Because he's going to give himself one, two. So he's got two, four. So I'm going to heal hopefully enough off of this to uh, live. I'm up to seven. Okay, good. Let's see. We will get rid of your hand. Two lands. All right. Well, here we go. We've hit reset. It really sucks that uh, I'm not getting any lands because I'm one away from getting gloom sower out. That's fine. Can I get a land, please? Please, may I get a land? Any land, please. Come on. I got the mutt. Are they attacking? They are not attacking. I've got my land. Hello, Gloom Sower. We will not attack. Hopefully. 7 4. Okay. We're going to wait again. So, bam. So he's going to ding me out. I see. I don't think I have any way of getting rid of that, so I'm on a timer. Essentially. Pass to blockers. You've got trample for seven, so I do have to block you with this. Let's see. Do this. And now, again, we're waiting. <clears throat> they basically got me dead. Because he's going to ping again with the mutt. 1-1 one, one will bring me to... We will activate ability. Pass the blockers. We will block with you. I mean, he's dead anyway, so it doesn't fucking matter. Oh shit, it's continuous. I did not know. That's pretty goddamn handy. Alright. We got our archer. And we will ping one of you dudes. And, uh, hmm. It's an aura. This is a sorcery, so it is not the same. So, we're gonna wait again. We're stalling out super hard here. I'm not getting any of my health. Yep. If I can get my health, that would be great. My turn. Oh, thank Jesus. Alright, so how am I going to do this? We're going to go with the archer. Do some damage. And then we're going to heal. 
gain four life, buy some time, buy some time. And then we're going to, uh, excuse me, enchant the steward. And then we're going to end turn. That's fine. The pace in which we're going to maybe win this first of three games might be uh might be hard. But but that's that's what I'm doing. He's got cards in his hand, he's thinking about doing things. He's gonna get rid of that, that's fine. I'm going to draw a card. That card is not useful. We are going to activate this ability. And I cannot activate it again. <clears throat> Unfortunate. And now I got a second land, so I'm just stuck here. He's going to ping. And we keep diddling our fi twiddling our fingers, being unable to do anything. All right, we have a mauler. You came a little late to the party, but we'll put this here, and we're just going to auto pass. No, we're not going to auto pass. Oh yeah. I hit the button too soon. Can I win in time? Probably not, because he's probably got a shock or two in his hand. But fuck if I can do anything about it. The frustrating slow death of a card game. Let's see. You. This may have bought me some time, but maybe not enough. We'll see if I can do it this turn. He's probably got a shock in his hand. I probably was two or three turns too late for this. But hey, we'll see. Come on. Come on. Just play a little magmut. Let's be done with it. Alright, so what we're going to do now is attack with one or two. We're going to do it with two and see if he uh, kills a blood glutton. He will do the mutt first. We have now healed. We will play and this, all right. He does get trample. He does not. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, that was only the first game. All right. <clears throat> so I see what they have. The steward, not that useful. Duress, useful. Uh, Blackguard was actually very useful. I didn't. I thought that was only one time. You can actually do it multiple times. Infernal Scarring felt very useless, but it did give me a card guy uh, draw. I don't know if he had any flying in there, but I figured we probably would have seen it by then. Do I want a second archer? 
No. But then what do I, what do I, excuse me, put in place? Is it going to be the walking corpse? Hmm. Hmm. I need something that's got lots of health. Cage zombie could be it. So we'll do that. Cage zombie in. And we'll see if this made any difference. I'm surprised I won that first game. <clears throat> Very surprised. This is a god-awful hand. This is a little better, but still very bad. We'll put the sower back in. And if he's got any early stuff, this is bad news. Or I just might die before I actually get to play any cards. We got nothing. Mine Rot's coming up next turn. Then Skeleton Archer after that. Alright, so this... It's probably a couple lands. Okay. Skeleton Archer is not going to do enough damage. And he's not going to get the Bullhound. I'm getting to eat a bunch of damage now. See, this is... This is a problem. I've just basically gotten... Loaded up on land. And, uh... I'm going to lose in record time. I don't think I'm going to live past this turn. If he has a second card to play here, I will kill the Bolt Hound and hope he doesn't have a shot because... Um, there ain't much else I can do about this. But I can get rid of future problems by doing this. So go ahead, use your shock. Yep, I figured there wasn't anything I was going to be able to do. I got shit draw that time. So as quick as that was, that was just shitty card draw. Uh, one life goes on, goes out. One walking corpse comes in, and we do it again. And hope I don't get eight million fucking lands like I did. Cause oh god, that was annoying. Let's see if this is any better. I'm going to play first. This is a little better. What do you got? Um. Volcanic geyser could be a problem, but shocks the immediate issue. We'll do actually a second duress. And we'll get rid of return to the return the slag. And now we'll put you down and mask blackguard. So he gets 2-0 till the end of turn. I'm fine. Take that. Buff him up. He didn't. Now we've broken even. I didn't get land. We'll put another one out. And see if he bothers to shock that. He didn't. So. We're just gonna go. Ping him for three damage. Woo. And then two red wizards. And then he's going to do a bunch of uh, prowess stuff, which I think I can actually get rid of one of them when I go to use the archer next turn. Does he want to use the volcanic eruption now or two damage to actually turn it into... Six? I don't know. He's thinking about it. And he's going to get rid of the black card with it? I would. 
hit me with it if he felt so inclined. Okay, yep, he's just gonna do that. This is fine. I'm expecting this. And now we'll do a little ping. Get rid of your little goblin guy. And now you're thinking about... <laughs> so that means you've probably got another spell, or at least you're hoping to, because that seems silly to uh, waste it on that. Yeah, okay. Get the blood glutton out. Uh, we're just gonna go ahead and attack with the archer. Unless he's got direct removal of my glutton on this turn. Um, okay, he doesn't. So now I'm gonna do the forest again. Keeping the one card in here. Attack with the archer again. And we'll end turn. He's got to either have a land or he's fishing for something because it seems odd. Unless he has something that he really... Okay. Is this another shock? Okay. That's fine. So is it going to be another... Another spell. Is he going to sacrifice the emulator to kill the blood glutton? I'll just bring him straight back. It goes right into my hand, though. That's fine. Who is the bigger issue? Um, I'd say you. Go ahead and uh, unfairly trade. Cast another spell. Okay, you didn't. All right. Hmm. So we're gonna have to uh, eat some damage for a bit here, I think. Or do I want to do the black art out here first? I think I do. And we'll put him back out. Just to get rid of some of the little weenies. I'm fine trading this. Is he going to... zap? Okay, he didn't. Alright, we'll trade you. Trade you. He's going to cast another spell. He does. I am pretty much done. Yeah. There's no, there's no way I can win this now. <clears throat> Fuck your card. And I'm done. Well, I expected to lose. It just took me way too long to actually get it to happen. So... I think what I'll probably end up doing with these videos, since this is, uh... hilariously bad, is I'll just cut up each game I play. Because I got two games to, uh... do this deck with. And each game will just be a different episode. So we'll just do that. In my bad, bad deck. Hopefully these things will go very, very quickly. I don't know. It is very hot in this room. I don't know how it got increasingly hotter through the end of the day, but it's insane. I hate it. My eyes hurt because I probably should turn some light on here, so give me a sec. Okay. So those stupid prowess things were a pain in the ass, but he had all the spells for it, and I couldn't do anything about it. So maybe I'll just play uh, Swamp here. 
And I'll keep the Mass Black Art as a uh, flash in case it uh, he attacks with anything that I feel like I need to get rid of. I think this is fine. We'll just do a uh, Mine Rot now. I don't think I got enough uh, card draw or card milling to actually make my original plan all that effective. Death Bloom Thalid, unfortunate. I don't really have much in the way of fucking um, creatures yet. All right, he's got little weenies, little weenie cards. I'm hoping I can pick something of use up in the uh, next card, because that would be very nice to actually get something of use, and I did. Okay, you still do not have enough. That's fine, I can flash in the Black Art and the Ranger's Guile. Alright, pass the blockers. We will flash you in. And then, who do I want to keep around? I can keep them both. No, I can't. So what we're going to do is this and this. And resolve. My turn. Okay. So that went a little better. So now I am going to uh, go ahead and uh, attack with you. <clears throat> and end turn. I still don't have enough land to actually boost up the black card to anything yet. <clears throat> Uh, uh, uh. And now you've wasted it. That apparently was a big enough issue that he felt the need to uh, use that. Although, granted, maybe I should have just let it die and then done the indulgence to get it back. But we'll see. We'll see what um, they do this time. Nothing. Okay. So if I play you, 2, 1, put you in, and then the 3, you will live. Ah, this is going well. I'm getting very fortunate cards. Thankfully, I mean, maybe I'm wasting too much on it, but again, also, I'm doing pretty well controlling them. So we'll put the Imp in, and then we'll have everyone attack. And then I'll activate so you don't die, and we'll keep the board control. <clears throat> Gloom Sower, huh? So if it becomes blocked by a creature, okay, that's fine. That is absolutely fine. And I actually, we got six here. Six, I wouldn't buff them up enough.
This is fine. And then we'll activate you. Can I activate you again? No, that's fine. That's fine. Now you're dead. Okay, let's see. I'm actually fine with this, so what I'm going to do is just have you... You be the attacker. Oh, I didn't activate enough, but that's fine. And now he's going to ping it. That's fine. So, if I gain four life, it'll be three less. And then we'll cast this. And then we'll bring out the, uh, bedded imp. Now, I kind of don't have an answer for this turn. So that's fine. Let's land out. Everyone just go ahead and attack. This one turned out a bit better. Not seeing my planeswalker yet. Bolt down's fine because he's going to die right now if he attacks. And if he doesn't attack, I'll just have the uh, imp do it. Forest down, and now it's my Gloom Sower. And we'll just keep pushing until he gives up. So we will put you down, and we will just continue. Um. Doing this. If you attack, you're dead. If you attack, you're dead. Because he does a 2 damage. There you go. I got lucky, I think, that uh, he didn't get any of the cards he needed. And I got all the duresses. So maybe I should do... Get rid of Infernal Scarring. Put in another duress. Just so I can keep that early game... Uh, pressure on him. I didn't see any flyings yet, so maybe run a foul is bad. So we'll get run a foul and uh, put in another archer, but they really don't have much in the way of one mana weenies. So maybe I'll put in a walking corpse just, just to be fodder. Just to be fodder. Sorry, I had a text. Okay, this one... It ain't good. I don't have as much cards, but I think we're gonna try it. We're just gonna go ahead and go with it. I think he's got a better start than me. Yep. He's already got a better start than me. Okay, that's fine. So, you can grab whichever one you want. I don't care. He didn't want to attack. Interesting. Um, we're not doing anything. Next turn, I can't do anything either. So, 
So he's a little concerned. I'm not going to block yet. Put another land out. Duress. What do you got? We'll get rid of that. And, uh... I guess we'll hit you for one. So, he's got that thing down now. Which sucks. He's gonna sacrifice and he's gonna ping. Get my Thieves Guild Enforcer. Which I can't do anything about. How quickly it turns. Alright, so... I can heal myself, bring the Thieves Guild guy back. Which I essentially have to do. And we'll put you back out. Get you to mill. Is it enough? It is still not enough. Jesus. Eight cards. Six. Nope. No blocks. I'm just buying time. Get the blood glutton out. He's got to have removal at this point. Yeah. And enough to actually buff him up and live. So he's dead. Oh well. He's going to push with the masked black guard. And he's got the cards that I don't have. It all quickly just turns around. I mean, essentially at this point, I'm fine with trading. I'm still got life. I've got no cards. I still don't have any cards. So... Yet to see the um, planeswalker, and now as quickly as I was winning, I am now losing, and I can't do anything about it except to put out a saber tooth mauler and hope he doesn't have anything to uh, deal with that. This is a bit unfortunate, because fucking hell. Oh, annoying. I'm just going to tap out here, because there's no way I'm winning this. I put in more duresses. I got zero du I got one duress. We're going to go right back to it. Ah. <sighs> I'm not even going to bother to look at the sideboard. There's nothing in there I want. This mode takes forever. Does it have to be best of three? Can it just be like, you lose four and then you're done? Or best of ones? I don't know. I didn't have a very um, congruent plan in mind. Again, another bad set of cards. We're going to stick with this. Get rid of the blood glutton. Put down the steward. Then corpse is next, unless I get like a mind rot, which he probably has, or a duress. Put it on the fire dog, because that's what's going to help. Unless you've got an arsonist. Okay. You do have a duress. So, I will duress. Blech. And we'll not 
attack. So he can put down that car, the steward, or the second arsonist. Okay. Going to be poor trading for a while now. If he decides to attack with the arsonist, which maybe he should. Yeah, you have to wait until you... Uh, Ah, uh, you know what? Fine. We'll do it. Ping the steward. I'm fine with it. We will put down the corpse. We will not attack. Because the... Unless he has a sorcery, he's going to play now, which makes me discard a card I don't want to. Be very annoyed. And no blocks. So I want the Mauler out for this. Okay. You out. Mauler out. And now we wait. So now I have at least an answer for everything here. That was just land. Ha ha ha. Now I've stalled him, essentially. Which is fine. We're, uh... We're gonna hang tight here. Fine. He can buff it up enough once... To kill my walking corpse. So hopefully, this is a smart play. He is still dead. Get value out of this. I don't know. I'm going to take a risk and do it. Probably just a land. Yep. Unfortunate. Now we just wait. See, it probably would have been smarter to put it here. But we didn't. So, put the forest down. Whatever, I'll put the black guard down now. And no attacks. I haven't gotten enough swamps to actually activate this more than once. Now I have. So I do it twice. That'll put him still in death range. But do I want to push it now anyway? I think I do. To make him react. So I'm going to. Stop the stalemate. See if he lets him go through. That's fine. Does he block? He does not. So I will just go ahead and pump him twice. And be fine with that. He's going to return 
return with whatever. I'll let them go, and then we'll just keep going back and forth. So, no blocks. Go ahead, pump them twice. He's got two cards on me. This is not an instant. So I'm going to wait. I want more value out of this mine rod. Stalemate again. We'll just do a tete-a-tete uh, -tete here. <laughs> I like pressing buttons too. See, he, he, I guess he doesn't count as a creature. That's unfortunate. See, if I had paid attention to the cards more, I would have known that I would have gotten. Oh, that's annoying. Shit. <clears throat> now he's pushed it in his favor. All right. Hmm. Hmm. I think I'm going to <clears throat> wait. Heck no, I'm going to push the issue. Do I? I don't think I do. I want more out of this mine rod, but I'm going to do it anyway. Fucking land again. God damn it. Alright, I'm going to get a trade out of this. Alright, so I got a trade out of this. <laughs> Can I get a card, please? One that I can use, please. Wow, that sucks. And we're just going to wait again. This fucking sucks. God. Oh. This game sometimes. <clears throat> this game sometimes. Can I get... I got 22 cards here. And I'm just gonna have to sit here and eat this for a while. <sighs> well, we're just gonna wait. I'm just gonna sit here and wait. I need to. Wow. Sometimes this game, I, I swear to Christ. Well, this is... I'll attack. Next. Next to damage. Heal me for four. Let me live a turn. End turn. If nothing else, this game really cans my peaches, grinds my gears, pisses me off. But it shouldn't. And I, I'm just getting eight million lands, and I, I, I'm, I'm at a loss. I'm at a loss. Frustration is sinking in 
immensely with these games. Sometimes when you feel like you're that close to getting something working, especially when they go two games of three and I still can't win. Oh well, we keep going. We persevere. And try not to let it get you mad. But see, it, it, I talked about it way back in the first uh, match we had, where this game is all about, yes, you can plan all you want, but you're all just hinging on what randomness is. You can have the greatest plan in place, have the greatest strategy, but when you get 8,000 lands in a row, it doesn't matter. We'll play first again. This is okay. I'm going to live with it. We'll see if uh, I can get this to work. I can keep him alive at least for two turns. With the hopes of actually getting... Okay, we did. So I'm going to duress... Jeskai, Elders, Truffle Snout. You got a Sabertooth Maul too, huh? Okay. Okay. Jeskai, Elder is... Just about doing damage. Okay. Another land. Mauler will come out next turn. I'm fine with... Nothing. We'll wait. He's got a land, and he's going to do Truffle Snout next. Give himself a bunch of little counters on his piggy. Make him a 3-3. That's fine. My turn. Another land, and we will do a Muller. And now... What I can do is sacrifice you, make you discard a card, and got you a 4 4. Okay. Good little synergy there. And now he's going to put his tiger down. And we play this game. So I can. Hmm. So I can do three land. No, I can't yet. So we're just going to wait. We're just going to wait. We're at a stalemate now. I have a couple of plans in mind. Nothing's really happening just yet. All right, so I can life goes on now. I think I will. And then we'll play Sanguine Indulgence. Take you, put you, put you, place you. We'll play a land, and then we will wait. All right, so now he's got all his Maulers out. So this is a problem. A very much problem. So again, we're at we're at land stalemate here. Which sucks. He's pushing them all. You want them all to attack, huh? Pass the blockers. Alright, we'll get rid of one cat. Are you gonna buff him? Guess what? Fuck. Well, that's not gonna help. This sucks. I got outplayed. I got outplayed. I very much got outplayed. And now... He is way ahead. And I'm again... Getting nothing but lands. 
Well, I can kill the elder. You are not a creature. You are a creature. God damn it. Well, I'm going to give up now because I'm not wasting any more time in that fuck up I had because he had a card that was much better than mine. I want to get rid of a land. One forest. And a swamp. I think I have too many lands. I want a duress. I want a mine rot. I'm going to get rid of a mine rot. And I'm taking alchemist gift. And we're playing this game. Maybe I had too much land. I probably don't. But when you have four games in a row where nothing but land. Granted, I lost it on that one, but I had no card unless I sacrificed that guy. There could have been a chance there. This is fine. I'm going first with some duresses. Hopefully I get a land. If I get nothing but friggin' uh, all right, Engraved Research goes away. <clears throat> we will do a second duress. And we'll get rid of Ranger's Guile. All right, got value. Now I just need a land. I didn't get it, so now this is where the game is. So you shouldn't have got rid of all your land. Now you're going to get nothing. Yep. Oh, God. This game. It just knows how to fuck with you. And it's doing a fantastic job of it right now. It's doing an amazing job of it. Well, Burlfist is just going to sit there. <clears throat> and keep hitting me because I am not blocking. And I hopefully can do something at the end of this turn. But it is not looking good. Because, of course, I didn't get any land. This will bring me to a 5-5. Five five, so hopefully, <clears throat> excuse me, I can uh, live a turn. All right. What we will do now is this. And if you counter it, well, all right. All right. Let me let me quit. Let me quit. You won't even give me the dignity to quit. You know, if me going into this, talk to me at the end of this, I would be slapping myself for not winning a game. And I got... I got grumpy at the end there. Well, at least let's see what I got for cards. You think you had an idea. It didn't go well. You never got any cards you needed. You tried changing it at the end, and nothing happened. I got one card I had not had before. Primal Might. I already owned. All right, well, that's almost 90 minutes total time of gradual frustration but that's this game i somehow still enjoy it i don't know if i like playing constructed that's why i don't pay the money i only got it for one of these things but i'm not going out of my way to use gems to do that i'll do it every now and again then remind myself why i don't like it but uh yeah that's enough of that for now i'll go back to making my own decks and losing with those because I feel like I have a little bit more control that way. Goodbye.